can there be an injunction to stop a prosecutor from otherwise enforcing a valid statute? That statute is Michigan's 1931 abortion ban, making it a felony for doctors and health care providers to perform abortions. In May, a court of claims judge sided with Planned Parenthood and issued an injunction to keep prosecutors from enforcing that law. On Monday morning, the Court of Appeals ruled that injunction doesn't apply to county prosecutors. Monday afternoon, Governor Gretchen Whitmer filed an emergency motion in Oakland County for a temporary restraining order to keep prosecutors from bringing charges. Judge Jacob Cunningham granting that order. We had no opportunity to respond, no opportunity to weigh in on the issues. And in our opinion, this is a egregiously wrong uh, injunction that the judge has issued. We're going to be in court tomorrow at 2.30 asking the judge to uh, lift the TRO. If he doesn't, and if he keeps it in place, we're going to appeal immediately to the Court of Appeals. David Coleman represents the prosecuting attorneys from Jackson and Kent counties, along with attorneys for Right to Life Michigan and the Michigan Catholic Conference. They've been fighting to enforce Michigan's abortion ban since the Supreme Court overturned Roe versus Wade. This is a, a very important moment when we're thinking about a law that makes a right that we've had for 49 years a felony, no exceptions for rape or incest. Um, this is out of step with the average Michigander who supports women being able to make these decisions, even if it's not one they would make themselves. Governor Gretchen Whitmer says she's hoping the Michigan Supreme Court will take up her case and rule for abortion rights in Michigan, which will likely be on the ballot for voters to decide, but not until November. The voters are going to have an opportunity to weigh in on the ballot initiative this fall. What I've been trying to do is just simply preserve the same rights with the same conditions that we've had for 49 years. But anti-abortion advocates say Michigan's 1931 abortion ban is the condition, the law, that should be enforced. The duty of a state is to uphold laws to protect the health and welfare and safety of the people. And so, you know, it's really sad to see the governor and the attorney general of Michigan refusing to enforce the laws that they have sworn to uphold. The next hearing is Wednesday afternoon in Oakland County. Amy Lang, Fox 2 News.